Oh my god, it's time to do this shit again. Hi everybody, welcome to the stream. <laughs> yeah, we're finally going to be looking into Sangi today. The, 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 the dark Sangi rises once more. And, um, you know, if you missed the, uh, the snake thing stream that I did a while ago, I'm sure most of you have seen it. It was a fairly popular one, uh, in spite of its subject matter. <laughs> but, uh, it was, uh, if you missed that, Sangi is essentially the friend of uh this dude snake thing who liked to molest puppies uh and and children and uh in the very beginning when we were reading the logs between sangi and snake thing it it felt it felt kind of like sangi might have had some kind of conscience or something he kind of felt like he was calling snake thing to stop doing what he was doing but we soon realized that it was solely because he was jealous that snake thing was getting like 14 year old boys uh and and sangi wasn't and also sangi's a uh, well you know this is a as as usual not a bully stream and uh, uh we wouldn't want to bully a uh a, a convicted pedophile but um yeah so uh, <laughs> um yeah it, it became pretty clear uh, pretty quickly i don't want to say that he he's a bitch but it became clear pretty quickly that, uh, yeah, he's a bitch. But, uh, he didn't want to go back to jail. He didn't want to endanger himself. He did want to, uh, victimize children. That much was clear. And he had no problem victimizing dogs either. But as long as he didn't get caught doing it, that was the only thing that mattered to Sangi. So ever since that stream, Sangi's become what we call the patron saint of sex weirdos. The law, f the, the, the chaotic evil patron saint of sex weirdos as opposed to the lawful good uh rich evans uh but but yes we we pop him up on the stream you can see him down in the bottom corner there and boy can we just take a look at the thumbnail that i chose to do real quick this i made this in about 10 minutes and it's not my best work certainly but what it is is a, a bit alarming uh, okay yeah you don't have to, you don't have to that's fine. I, I didn't actually want that to be in the in the stream. It's okay. You don't need to actually bring it in. But what this is is alarming because why is why is Sangi's mugshot more attractive than you know more more attractive than this like proper picture that isn't a mugshot? I don't know, but uh we're gonna you know, we're gonna get all the Sangi info. We're gonna be f furnished with every Sangi information. And uh, this is gonna be uh, this is gonna be an exciting one. Let's see. What should I do first? Well, if you're not familiar with Sangi, I guess the first thing that's necessary is for me to take a sip of this Red Bull. Hang on. I've substituted the whiskey for something that's equally unhealthy but um, less fun. So, um, anyways, if you're not familiar with Sangi, there are a number of logs which we have read. We've already seen these on stream before, but I'm going to read a couple of them. I'm going to kind of skim through them a bit, and um, we're going to get an idea for, you know, what your boy Sangi is all about. So uh, what's a good one to start with? Well, firstly, we would like, uh, you know, we need to we need to be sure to show Sangi in the proper light as he is a he is a very good boy, you know. Uh, he he might be, he might possibly be a little bit of a a little bit of a sex weirdo. He might be a convicted pedophile, but you know he stands up for for social justice, and that's what's important, as we all know. So uh, transphobia, racism, and other bigotry on IB. I don't even know what that is. Inked, bu Inked Bunny. I think that's his site, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I guess before I even read this, just drop this down here. Have it, like, right below him. That's good. But uh, before I even read this, I guess I should mention, who is Sangi exactly? You've probably been watching the streams for a little bit, intrepid chat member. You've probably been watching for a little bit, or you haven't been. Either way, you probably are wondering, unless you've, you know, read his Kiwi Farms thread or anything like that, you might be wondering who the, who exactly is Sangi. Outside of the the uh, the logs with, with Snake Thing. Well, Sangi is a, a furry. He is a... Uh, 
a DJ who goes by a couple of different names. I think he's known as uh, DJ Toboe, DJ Nativus. That's his like full fake furry name is Sangi Nativus. And uh, yeah, he's like a, a trance DJ or something. He's got some kind of website for like furry porn, I think, called Inked Bunny. And he's like a fairly well-known uh, furry in the community. And apparently they haven't kicked him out of the community yet, so that's interesting. But, um, yeah, so before we get into, you know, the, the real meat and potatoes, I felt like it was necessary to point out he's like a webmaster. He's pretty well known. I don't think he's like an artist exactly, but he is a musician, kind of. We're going to get to listen to some of his wonderful music, chat. I wonder if it's going to be able to compete with Onision or Justin RPG's music, but, uh, you know, that'll that'll... That'll be, uh, that remains to be seen, but what, you know, the other thing that's important to know about him is again, he's a very good boy. Um, this weekend has been rough. We had literal Nazis in the street. A car driver murdered one person, but he tried for dozens and a black man was beaten outside a police station. Police officers did little until people started dying. It is ridiculous. Many businesses have taken a stand against racists and bigotry, and even Fur Affinity has started cracking down on it harder, suspending Rory Raccoon. Well, I'm glad that Fur Affinity decided to crack down on somebody who has the wrong opinions, but, you know, didn't decide to close down Cepheus Rivendale's account where he actively talks to people who get his fucking telegram so that he, that he can share pictures of the dog that he's raping. It's a good thing that's that, that, uh, fur affinity didn't decide to close that guy's account, but they decided to close Rory raccoon for being like, I guess a Republican. I don't know. That's, that's cool. Um, that's, that's super cool. But uh, Ink Bunny, they seem to be allowing the hate speech to continue. I'm disgusted that Rory and others are using IB as their platform to spew their bigotry and club f and, and cub furs in general seem to be taking an alt-right view on things. Guys, the cub furries are alt-right. You know, f you know the alt-furry movement? The, the a-woo-movement? Well, now we've got an alt-cub furry movement. That's wonderful. Um... This is this is ridiculous as a huge amount of cubs are gay and our president would not take kindly to it. In fact, our vice president would gladly shock you in the balls. Come on, Sangi, you know you'd gladly shock someone in the balls too if if Come on, Sangi. <laughs> Don't pretend that's not something that you'd be into. Come the fuck on. Add implied pedophilia on top of that and well, oh, do we want to add that on top of it? Okay. Add implied pedophilia on top of that. There you go. Just imply that pedophilia real quick. Yeah, the the right aren't exactly our friends. Guys, remember, if you have the wrong if you are on the right side of the spectrum politically, you can't be friends with Sangi. That I know that that's a pro I know that that's really disappointing for all of you. I know that you all I know that all of you MAGA folks probably wanted to, to go, like, you know, baby seal clubbing with Sangi or whatever, but that's just never going to happen because you've got the wrong opinions, okay? And Sangi clearly has the right opinions. We need to start making it clear that this shit isn't acceptable in our fandom. Yes, among the many things that aren't acceptable in the fandom, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say this is not the highest on the list, but okay. Uh, we need to act, we need to aggressively block those that spew this crap and let them know this isn't okay. If we do not fight against hate, it will just grow and grow. Just like the Sangi. It will just grow and grow. Um, we can't stand by and let our community become rotten with hate. So yes, yeah, Sangi, as we know, is a very good boy who, uh, you know, as, if you want to rape kids and dogs, it's fine. But as long if you even think about being slightly fiscally conservative, that's it, fucker. Friendship ended. Friendship fucking ended. All right. So so that gives you a bit of an example on, uh, you know, Sangi, uh, as as he would like people to believe that he is. 
And uh, if you've missed the snake thing stream, now it's time for an example of what Sangi actually is. Now, uh, I would like to, uh, I'd like to just, I'd like to just say now, I don't do fucking trigger warnings because I'm not a bitch, but this is not going to be very comfortable stuff to see. I'm not going to go through it all in great detail like I did with the snake thing stream because I did already do that. I'm not going to read through it all again, but I am going to read through a few of these logs. And uh, yeah, I guess if you, uh, I don't know, I guess if you don't think you can handle the kind of stuff that fuck it's my stream come on you know what you're in, in fuck off listen anyways so here is sangi talking to snake thing about um you really do need a kid to fuck let's drug blank and hump his butt colon d joking 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 of course j j just jokes just, just fun jokes these are the kind of jokes that you share when you're not a weirdo sangi mm, i don't think the drugs would be needed Perhaps, says Snake Thing, they may not. It'll loosen him up a bit so you can enter him a lot easier. You'd be able to get in quite deep, I'd imagine. I'm sure before when I read this, I made a ha-ha penis small joke, but I think it still fits. Anyways, uh, yeah, so that's Sangi. That's a little bit of a little bit of a departure from the good boy that we saw in that journal there. Uh, glad I'm three beers deep. You said it yourself, chat member. Um, so... <laughs> so uh what else do we have here oh here's the here's the kid slut log yes um does having that image make me a kid slut says sangi yes sir it does snake thing says don't worry though being a kid slut is quite the promotion over a regular one trust me colon three Ha ha, says sangi i sure don't see much action for being a slut anything even as a Kitty diddler, Sangi can't get it fucking wet. Good, good job, bro. That's what happens when you look like a thumb, I guess. Uh, true, colon three, says Snake Thing. That's why you're a kid slut now. Gotta get all them young'uns and corrupt the fuck out of them, colon P. Giggles, XD. Now, obviously, that's not Sangi that is uh, saying that there. You can see that's Sangi's the one with the pink, but... uh. You know, do you think that a normal person who isn't a, a, a piece of shit would uh, willingly be in a group with people like this? I don't know. That's, in my opinion, they probably wouldn't. Um, so, let's see. What else What else is there here? What, what's this one? It's a bit of, bit of a long one. Iggy. Uh, Sangi's not in this one too much. But uh, maybe this one. Ooh. This is the one. Okay, it's not the one. This is not the one. Sangi's role here... The thing about Sangi is that he really is not as interesting as someone like Snake Thing. The, the problem is, though, is that he's still f a free, you know, person. And apparently the cops are just cool with that. So, I mean, I don't know. Uh, he doesn't really get into quite as much, like, disturbing detail as Sangi does... Or as uh, Snake Thing does. But, I mean... There's certainly enough here that it, 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 you know, raises a couple questions. That's all. Uh, what did I say? Fine, I'll wait patiently for you to view f young 14-year-old boy butt, says Snake Thing. When my roommate can't see my screen, XD, says Sangi. And stop seducing minors, damn it. He's uncut, too. Seriously, if you don't stop, I'm going to talk to your mom. Now, again... This is something we thought when I first did the Snake Thing stream. I thought that maybe Sangi might have been, like, one of the people that, like, betrayed the, the weirdos and, like, leaked the logs or something. Because there was a little bit of this where it was like, if you don't stop, I'm going to talk to your mom. Like, he's kind of trying to tell Snake Thing not to do what he's doing. But it became increasingly apparent as we went on. And I wonder if we're going to be able to find the right pictures here, because these are all, like, pretty disorganized. Um, Sangi, you told me you'd stop and your mom extended more trust to you. Um, and, you know, again, it looks, it kind of looks like he's, you know, kind of looks like he's got some kind of conscience or something. I think she made an error, and maybe I did, too. 
So again, it almost it almost looks like Sangi is like you know on the right on the right side here. It almost looks like he's like, oh, this is a little a little fucked up, bro. Maybe you should uh, maybe you should fucking stop. But uh, hang on. Oh God, what's the right one? There you go. Get rid of that one. So uh, yeah, it almost looks like that. But the, again, the further that we got into this. <laughs> the more we started to realize, you know, he's just, like, jealous. He's just, like, jealous of fucking... He's, like, a jealous boyfriend who's upset that the dude he's with is, like, fucking children, and he's not able to fuck children. That's that's what's happening. That That's what we became increasingly aware was going on here, was this fucking guy... Didn't have a conscience, didn't have any kind of like, oh, this is a bad thing you're doing, snake thing. Maybe you shouldn't do this. Maybe you should fucking quit. Uh, he, he just was like, he just was like a fucking like clingy. I don't know, man. Um, it's not jealousy, man. It's morality. He is a good boy. Yeah, he's a good boy. Obviously. He's obviously a good boy. So we've seen some of these logs. There's a few more logs to look at here. I think we'll probably get to that, but I think I've shown enough of that to give you some idea. There's a lot of stuff that Sangi has been involved with in that group. This, if you're not familiar, this uh, once again, this is the zoo. This is the zoo sadist people, uh, which you may have heard of. You probably saw my video about it if you're on this stream now. But this is the zoo sadist people, and Sangi was in that group, and he was friends with these people. So I mean. Just let that, you know, let that be in your mind as we continue. If you're not already familiar with him, you know, now you are. Anyways, uh-oh, SpaghettiOs, here's a mugshot. Hmm. Now, we don't know why. You can see I, I blanked out some of the locations and stuff, uh, but not the name, because his name is, like, public, so it's fine. But we, we don't know why James Sangi Hoyt was, was arrested in uh 9 11 2008 boy all the all the worst things seem to happen on 9 11 huh we we don't really know why he was arrested but we know certainly that he was and names and aliases dj toboe we got the fifty thousand dollar bond amount i don't really know how this shit works in uh I don't know. I don't really know how this shit works in the United States, but like, if you've got a fifty thousand dollar bond amount, doesn't that mean you need to like put up fifty thousand dollars to get out of jail? Doesn't that isn't that what that means? So, I would assume that he. I don't know. I guess did that. I, I'm not sure, but here's another mug shot. A different mug shot. This is an or an earlier mug shot when he got booked in on. 2-11-2008, and he got released like a month and a half later or something, the amount of $25,000 for the bond for this one. Boy, it seems like Sangi can't quit, can't stop getting in trouble. Of course, that was like, you know, over 10 years ago, but I mean, hmm. Oh, we got another mugshot here. Get a load of this dapper young gentleman, this, this epic gamer. You can't even, you can't see the, the, the trench coat that he's wearing there in all its full glory, but this is the this is the face of like V. Look at those ears. Look at those fucking like Dumbo ass fucking fly me to the goddamn moon ears on this motherfucking guy. Look at the side of he head. Anyways. Um But this one was from a couple years before those. Booked in 1214. 2006 released like a year later bond 15,000 and then 50,000 so I don't know apparently two different bonds this seems to be the most serious offense that he got involved with whatever it was uh, among the ones that we can see anyway this seems to be one of the more serious offense. apparently he was age 30 in 2006 which means he's like what fucking 44 now I, th I thought he was like 36 now or something but apparently he's like i guess he's in his fucking 40s now i don't know 
But anyways, yeah, Sangi keeps fucking getting arrested. Interesting. Sure is interesting how someone who's such a good boy, good boy, who stands against that implied pedophilia that the right wing people are doing. It's interesting how many times he seems to be getting him himself in jail. You know, that's I don't know. That's it's crazy. Uh, what 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 do we got here? What do we got here? Oh, sucks about RMFC. Uh, also sucks when you know someone in the fandom is actively molesting underage people and you can't do shit about it. Yeah, it sucks when you know someone in the fandom who's molesting children and they didn't bring you to their party, doesn't it, Sangi? Isn't that just the worst, Sangi? I know, I, I'm sure, I'm sure, I, you know, I can't sympathize, but I can empathize. Or, or maybe that's the other one, I don't know, but, uh, yeah. Hmm. Interesting tweet to be making there. I don't know. Uh, now we can take a look at this. This is going to be a little bit of a hard one to look at. Not because it's like uh, intensely fucked up. I mean, it is a Sangi stream. It is something on the Sangi stream. But uh, it's going to be a little hard to look at just because it's very like zoomed out, zoomed in. It's it's going to be in pretty small, uh, pretty small text. But this is him making some kind of like... Daki Makura or something of uh, fucking like Cub Simba from Lion King. He isn't making it, but he's talking with somebody who is making it. And he he's the one on the left, I guess, as usual. Needs a communist Marxist symbol, though, uh, for people to get their panties in a twist over. So we got we got communist Marxist Simba. Cub Simba with like a fucking rainbow flag. Uh, that's wonderful. Um, job done. Oh, woof. African Prince XD. Why am I laughing at that? Good God. Even though he just turned 18, this little lion still hasn't. This is this is Sangi talking, by the way. Still hasn't outgrown his mane or grown out his mane. He's a sweet little boy, though, and loves to be cuddled. Can you help? Only with briefs, though. Totes legal, says Sangi. You know, when you're doing something that's legal and is not weird and should not be frowned upon by society, you, you usually mention that it's legal during the conversation. Um, inked fur. So he's linking to, I th again, I think that's his site. And that might not be his site. It might be a different site. That might just be one that he's like on. I'm not sure, but he links to this. Um, XD. God, the description. Hey, I'm protecting me and my customers. We have a lot of international buyers. Uh, don't doubt it. Just roll. I don't give a fuck if you put in a cub tag, says Sangi. Just on the store, it needs to say, Dis be adult. Not a real child, quote unquote, and then a smiley face. XD, I understand. This is a drawing, says Sangi. It's just very, very on the nose. And another smiley face. I'm sure someone will ask why he isn't a black lion if he's an African prince. XDD. Pence will probably say that because he's an idiot. That's right, Sangi. Fucking J John Pence. Is that his name? John? I don't. I don't. I don't know. F J Jimmingham Pence is going to see your weird fucking Simba cub porn pedo Daki Makura with the communist Marxist fucking rainbow flag on it. Oh my god! I can't believe these are the words that I'm saying right now. This guy's so like, I you know. I hate to use I hate to use a meme term like Trump Trump derangement syndrome because that is a bit of a meme. But wow, when you can't even stop talking about fucking, I think it's my isn't it Michael? I don't I don't remember when you can't stop talking about pets during your fucking like child child weird fucking weird fucking logs when you can't stop talking about pets during that shit. You know that you need to just, like, disconnect from the internet. I, like, don't worry, dude. The roving right-wing death squads aren't going to fucking... They aren't out to get you unless they find you balls deep in a schnauzer. Anyways, um, let's see. Oh, right. Pillow not included, so I have to get one from somewhere. XD. Hmm, you should draw that damn art. Uh, you have to keep using offlinks. Patreon can host attachments. Yeah, but they downgraded. I'd rather blah, blah, blah. I run two Patreons, smiley face. Nope. Well, meh. Attach them as files, not as the main image. 
The main image is compressed, blah, blah, blah. Are you sure they'd be okay with hosting literal cub porn, asks the artist. And we get the stupid anime face, shifty eyes face, and then the colon line face. No, that's the issue. Lol, external link it is then. If you posted feline penis, people would complain it wasn't human. If it bothers them so much, they can get the underwear version. At least people are okay with the underwear version. QQ. Well, I love his penis, says Sangi. Like an actual child. I mean human. Just make sure that's bigger. A little, just a little, a little bigger so you can, you know, just make sure that you can see it. Um, Sangi telling this person, well, I love his penis, which, by the way, I did have to blur out here. I love his penis, says Sangi, like an actual child. I mean human. So just, you know, remember, Sangi is a good person. He's a good person who stands against bad things and bad people like like Mike Pence. I think it is Mike Pence, but it's bad, bad people who like borderline pedophilia and things like that. The evil right wingers. But he does love those actual human uh, child penises. So um, let's see. Cub friendly furry smut immigrant alternative. And this is a site that I believe Sangi operated or perhaps still operates called my.cutepaw.ws. And it's a furry friendly image hosting site, which is a cub friendly furry smut imager alternative. How, how are they about human Shota, though, asks this friend. Well, I run the site, says Sangi, so don't care, smiley face. But how do you feel about it, though, asks the friend. I love it and have gigs of it. Hang on. Hold on. Hang on. We're, we're getting this. We're getting this bread. We're getting that paper. I love it, says Sangi, and I have gigs of it. Just need to make sure that he's like. His face is here. It's like the signature for this. For this post, it's like Sangi approved. So he's like Chef Excellence Sangi. Um, yeah, so so he has gigs of uh, human Shota, everybody. If you're not familiar with the term Shota, uh, it 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 refers to uh, it refers to basically the male version of Loli. Um, so in other words, he has gigs of human child porn he loves it he has gigs of it very interesting stuff you know um we're learning so much about sangi today we're just learning so many interesting things about sangi uh what's this one here this is uh some sort of fur affinity thing i love cub and hope to see some boy cubs from you soon says sangi I love Cub, everybody. Remember, remember, anybody who ever tells you that they like Cub porn is a child rapist. If they haven't raped a child yet, they will. They're going to. They're a child rapist. Cub porn means child porn. So, your boy is a huge, huge fan of, uh, of Cub porn. And human Shota, of course. Um... Anybody here wondering now, or anybody here still wondering why Sangi is our patron saint of sex weirdos? Let's get that, let's get that Sangi just front and center there. That's good. That's really good. So, uh, yeah, that is, that is about that for the stuff that I have saved in this folder. Now we're going to be looking at some websites and things. Uh, hey, Chad, how you doing? Make it go away. It's Leafy without his hat. You know, Leaf between Leafy and 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 Sangi, they almost have one full chin. I'm going to throttle him with my diamond armor in Minecraft. I want to feed this guy to a grown lion. What is it with all the prevalency of cub porn? I don't know. Cub porn is one of those things that I guess 
I I've, I literally described it at a Cards Against Humanity game one time as a throwaway or as a as a, a write in card as babies, but they're also animals. So apparently that makes it okay, and that's pretty much what it is. Like they don't. I think there's like a layer of abstraction where they're like, well, it's just it's not child porn. It's cub porn, everybody. It's fine. And if you say that to somebody, then they don't assume naturally. I guess maybe also they look slightly different from human children enough that it's I don't know. But yeah, I guess they think they can get away with it. But reminder, anybody who fucking talks about their deep seated love for cub porn is not just stopping at cub porn. I can assure you of this much. Bad, Sangi. Bad. Go to your room. You did a bad, and I'm taking your computer and phone and 3DS. Shit, chat member. You're going fucking ham. Jesus, take the torture wheel. Please strangle Sangi. Doesn't P.K. Russell follow a bunch of cub artists? Yes, well, apparently P.K. Russell is also a degenerate piece of shit, so we might have to look into him at some point. Um, I find it more disgusting that the other degenerates don't step in and stop this ultra degeneracy. Well, you know, thing about Sangi, thing about furries, and we talked about this when I did the Cepheus stream, is, um, there seems to be quite a lot of them. And I know everybody in chat's going to explode into this fervor of, oh, but not all furries, but not all furries. But there sure seems to be quite a lot of them who apparently know that people like Cepheus and Sangi are still free. And they know what they did. And they know that there's evidence of these things. But they're cool with it. That's okay. It's fine. Probably because they also want to fuck animals. Uh, again, I can mention that Apparently, Fur Affinity will yeet you off of the fucking site if you have uh, if you own a MAGA hat. But if you have literal pictures on the internet of you balls deep in a dead deer like Cepheus, well, you know that's okay. They can let that slide while people in his comments proceed to ask him for his Telegram so that they can do pervy things. Yeah, no, that's fine. That's fine. So I uh, yeah, again, talking about these people always makes me you know. It really, really jog joggles the old noggin. I, I don't think joggle is a word, but it should be. It really joggles the old noggin. It, it really makes you think, doesn't it? Why, why are there so many furries who seem to be totally okay with Sang Sangi being free? Well, why is there more of an outcry when a furry wears a fucking MAGA hat than there is when somebody fucks a dog? Why is that not a bigger problem for the furry people? And I know there's going to be some people in chat who are like, well, it's a problem for me. Well, good. Maybe it should be a problem for the fucking majority of you people. Oh, sorry, bully stream. Sorry. But anyways, um, it's time to get into. What are we going to get into now? Let's see. What are we getting into here? Okay. Oh, well, we should look at this Twitter, first of all. Um. So this is a Twitter account of his called Social Justice Werewolf, which, you know, already off to a fucking fantastic start with that name. Social Justice Werewolf. What do we got? You guys think I should keep the fake PNG Chris Hansen on screen, by the way? I feel like that really adds a lot to the to the stream. I don't know. That's just me. Um, Social Justice Werewolf. Gay, 36, cis male, Antifa, he, his, red wolf, business owner, art lover, need inked fur help? Go to inked fur prints. Um, oh, that's right. Ink Bunny is not his site. Inked fur is his site. It's just almost the same name. That's why I got confused. Um, over 135,000 Nazis and sympathizers and apologists blocked. Use block together and subscribe to block together. Yes, chat. Sangi unironically endorses the use of the fucking Randy Harper block bot from Gamergate. No, I'm not kidding. Yes, that is on the screen right now. And yes, you are also reading this with me. He is actually, he is actually in support of the, the, the block bot. Oh, that's wonderful. 
Uh, we got some Robin Hood stuff. You, you know, pe- people like him love Disney. I think we found the main Disney demographic. It's it's sex weirdos. Uh, help me telegram. You don't look so hot on the Apple iPhone X. Um, she just threw... I'm screaming at all this tea she just threw on white America. This is a this is a message from Sangi, by the way. Sangi. Sangi is screaming at all the tea that this lady just threw on white America. White America. The Hugh Whites, if you will. Um Right. Uh, not a wolf. And Antifa whispered, crime is good to me on the bus, but now I can never prove it. Prove it. When will this nightmare end? And it's almost like there's a... Uh, that, w- that would be a funny joke if there wasn't, like, mountains of evidence of Antifa people, like, breaking the law. So that would be a really funny joke. Uh, SJ Werewolf, I just realized the app sucking the most battery in the BG after the iOS 11 update is Telegram. Not optimized for 11 yet. Maybe that's, uh, you know, maybe that's um, Apple or whoever the fuck runs Telegram looking into your shit. Maybe that's why. Maybe you should take that to heart. So, again, you know, you look at this and it's like, this is this is the account. I I would just like you all to assume that anytime you come across somebody with fucking Antifa and pronouns in bio and they're they're bitching about fucking Trump like six years after he got elected or whatever the fuck. They're they're retweeting blue check marks, making epic woke jokes. Just just remember that they're probably all also like Sangi. Just remember. Oh, oh, we can't forget. Sangi is a big fan of Sean, the 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 bread tube person. Now, personally, I I I am a fan of uh of of Big Joel and and Jenny Nicholson, so I'm probably not in any place to talk, but yeah. Yeah, he's a patron of Sean's actually. He actually gives money to Sean every month. Uh so I wonder if Sean knows that he's collecting shekels from from Sangi, from from a convicted pedophile and uh, and dog fucker. Well, I, we actually we don't know if Sangi's a dog fucker. We just know that he he's very good friends with a number of dog fuckers. That's all we know. Um, let's see. We got some more fucking blue check marks bitching about politics. Uh. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Well, we didn't see that. That's fine. That's that's fine. Uh that's okay. So that's, you know, some example of the That's some example of the uh the the Sankey page. <laughs> the social justice werewolf page. Let's move along to uh Well, this is his DJ page. And we're going to just be real careful about that one. But this is his uh this is his DJ page. He hasn't posted in a few years. Oh my god, but this this page is almost is also a banger. Get a load get fucking guys. Loved you on Colbert, Femfreck. And then we also have some I think there was some more fem Oh yes, another great video from Femfreck. Women as reward. Tropes versus women in video games. So again, reminder that everybody who in who supports f- feminist frequency is you can probably just assume they're exactly the same as Snake Thing or rather uh Sangi. My bad. Got the got the wrong name there. Uh uh look at this look god, look at this fucking face. Look at the uh, the banner here, guys. Don't you want to... He, you know what you're missing on that car, Sangi? You need a free candy sticker. You, you need a free candy bumper sticker. That's... that's. I mean, how are you going to lure the, the five-year-olds in? I mean, sure, it's a smoking hot car, and you're definitely not compensating for anything, but but where are you going to get all the five-year-olds? Also, uh, a retweeting Chank Uger. Uh, loving every laugh. L-E-L. Uh, so... You know, that's there's not that much to look at on this page. Um, this is mostly. Oh, do you host stolen content, child porn, or doxing organization Chans? Protect yourself by choosing Cloudflare. Guys, why are there so many convicted pedophiles who are like, like this guy? You know what I mean? Like, I I don't know. 
You'd think he just wouldn't. I, I, I don't know. You think he wouldn't you know, poke that bear? May I? Mm, I, I don't know. But anyways, we know that we know that Sangi's not in the habit of poking bears anyway. So uh, let's let's move on uh, to uh, let's see. Oh, uh, the Sangi Nativus on SoundCloud, everybody. We're gonna get to hear his SoundCloud. It's this is very exciting. Now he hasn't uploaded anything on the SoundCloud in several years. He's got this from six years ago, eight years ago. These are this one. Oh, this one is an hour and seventeen minutes. Guys, we're about to go on a sonic journey. Yeah, we're about to go on a musical journey. I hope you're ready for this. This is the dance demo from Sangi. I know you guys have been waiting for Sangi's wonderful music. But we're about to hit that fire mixtape, everybody. And uh And every comment on this is from Is this just a fucking Oh god, I can't even play this because it's all fucking remixes of like Rihanna and shit. God damn it. Turn it down. God, I hate it. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, I don't fucking like trance even when it's good, so I mean... Boots, cats, boots, cats, fuck, cats, fuck, cats. That, that should be the beat, you know? Make a whole song out of, like, fucking cats, fuck, cats. That'd be good. Uh, so that's the dance demo. Let's check out Advert for Lunar Melodies. This is a radio ad for Furry FM of my new show, Lunar Melodies. Are we going to get to hear his wonderful, wonderful... Oh, fucking pedo, also high... Oh, okay, hello. Um, are we going to get to hear his wonderful, uh, his wonderful voice on this? I, I hope so. Lunar Melodies with DJ Nativis on Furry FM and trance music. Well, this is exactly as greasy as I expected him to sound. Come to Fairy FM with DJ Nativis, everyone. Yeah. Yeah. Come to Fairy FM. Oh, by the way, we've got some fucking choice people in chat. Josephine live. I love sex. Tap photo. Join me. Thank you. Thank you, Josephine. You know, I also love sex. What a, we're a match made in heaven. You know, I'm I'm gonna be really disappointed if you turn out to be a sex bot. You know, you know what? That would be bad. Um, don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. I can only handle so many. I can only handle so many women lying to me in a year. Anyways, so that's the that's the uh, SoundCloud. And uh, you know, again, we we don't get to hear too many of his wonderful tunes. I wonder if he's got. I guess he's got some like remixes. No, these are. Okay, these are not, these are from different things, but these are from different people. Is there like Mix Cloud? Oh, you can find more of his mixes over here. Guys, we're going to get to hear more of his music if this page opens. Okay, the page is opening. We get to hear more Sangi music. I'm so happy about this. Three years ago, we've got like episodes of his show. We got like okay, we got like original songs here, everybody. This is from seven years ago. Okay, well this isn't a song. It's two it's like an hour and a half, but but it's something and it's two it's it's uh tunnel vision. Just looking down the barrel of a child's anus, as as you do when you're sangy. Um So what the fuck is this? What what the fuck is this? This isn't even like a song. This isn't even like his own shit. It's just like a mix of some other shit that other people made. I guess that's what being a DJ is, but... Anyways, it's not playing. This one's... Ooh, this one. This this one has his face. Did, 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 did you guys see the... Did you guys see the face? Sadly, these aren't playing, because I think this website's like from fucking China or some shit. I don't know. I've never fucking heard of this site, but can we play this one? The one with his face? I want to hear Sangi's face. I don't know. It's not playing. This is this is a problem. But 
The other problem is, again, if you look at this, playing tracks by Mr. Sam featuring Kirsty Hawkshaw, the dog. It's not even, he's not even playing his own shit. It's not even his songs. This guy's not even a fucking musician. What a fraud. Jesus. I love you. I love the excuse of, oh, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a DJ. That's, that's, it, it means I'm an actual musician. Totally. It totally doesn't mean I'm just throwing together a bunch of fucking songs that other people made. I guess if he was like remixing them, that would be something, but it doesn't even look like he's remixing them. It just says he's playing songs from them. Is it just like a fucking mixtape of songs? Anyways, so surprise, surprise, Sangi's music is a bit of a fucking meme. So, and and not do, doesn't even really exist. So uh, let's let's move on here. Oh, here's a good page. This is a wonderful page. This is the uh, the the archived wiki fur page for Sangi, and as you can see here, uh, it's a fur, furry DJ, the owner of Inked Fur. Uh, Sangi's been active in the furry fandom since 2006. Oh, he was also active in prison in 2006. That's so cool. Starting off as a gray wolf in 2007, he fell in love with red wolves and decided to base his character on them. Blah, blah, blah. Mobile life. Blah, blah, blah. Music. DJ hobby. I love how at the bottom of this page, by the way, after all of this shit, talking about him being a musician and all of this like generic shit about your average person. Oh, what's this? The controversy section. What's that? Oh, God damn it. What the fuck? How did I just lose the what? Okay. The controversy section. Sangi is a convicted pedophile. So it's like, so it's like this whole fucking page is just like, oh, yeah, he's a furry DJ. He really loves Red Wolves. Uh, he's lived in a few places. He's the, you know, first uh, Fritz Fox was one of the first furries he met in per. Oh, yeah. And he's a convicted pedophile, by the way. Just thought we'd also mention that just at the bottom of the page. It's that's no big deal. That's fine. That's fine. The furries, the furries accept all people. Okay. We are all, we open our arms to all animals. I mean, people, all types of people. Uh, so yeah, that's the wiki fur really on top of things there in the wiki fur guys. I'm sure you're not I'm sure you're not fucking in on it anyway. So, uh, DJ Toboe finally back. This is a page from, uh, oh, yes, this is his live journal. This is his fucking ancient live journal from like 2006. Hang on. When was he arrested? When the fuck? He was, uh, he was arrested in, hang on. He was arrested multiple times, yes, but the one time was in 2006. So, this was in, tw this was on 12-14-2006. This was the 14th of December, 2006, when he got arrested for that one. And he was away for how long? Till the eleven, till the nineteenth of Fe of November two thousand seven, so nearly a year. And, and meanwhile, here on his ancient live journal, which I didn't even know existed in two thousand four, by the way, but here in his ancient live journal, we can see his last post was in December first of two thousand six. Hmm. He's just talking about trance shit. It's really lame. It's not interesting. And you can see his other stuff. You know, uh... If anyone could help a little wolf out, that'd be great. Um, but yeah, he's like... This is from 2005. Air Courier. Uh, and I remember when I was first looking at this page, I had not yet given a serious look at the, um... The mug shots that I showed... And I did not see the part where, you know, it mentioned the specific years that he was, uh, he was incarcerated. And so, uh, I, I, I thought when I was looking at this, I was like, oh, this is from like 2006 or something and, and further back. By the way, the final post on here is about everybody loves Raymond and it's from summer of 2004. <laughs> so that's pretty, that's pretty cool. Uh, we're going to get the everybody loves Raymond DVD starting with season one. 
Guys, you can't miss out on that. That is a TV classic. God damn it. I used to watch Everybody Loves Raymond. You fucker. You don't you are not going to ruin more things for me. I finally landed something. Um Yeah, child. Xena meetup. Um my website finally bite the bullet. But yeah, I was gonna say when I uh when I was first looking at this page, I I assumed, well, these are all old entries. This is probably from before he became a sex weirdo. You know? This is going to be from like 10 years ago, you know, and then I found out that most of his arrests were actually like shortly after this. Um, we've got this whole part here about like, what the fuck is this? This whole rave scene is a snare of the devil, leading many young people to worship the devil as they destroy their mind and bodies, uh, leading to an early death and an eternal doom separated from God in hell. Rawful. Okay, so here I was Google image searching for Raver Chick for some reason. I forgot by now. Anyways, I found Isker's site in the process, and I haven't laughed so long for a while. Uh, this is the way it's written. Okay, so this is like a funny site for, for Raver people. Okay, that's cool. So I, I thought that was him being crazy, but it's not really. Um... He's in Florida with his Xbox. So not that much of interest here. He's not really going over his whole, like... Huh. Huh. I'm sorry. No, I'm just reading this. Thought this would be easy. He's getting contacts. He could have been blind. He went to McDonald's and got a quarter powder combo. Thank you for letting us know. Uh... Huh. Okay. Wait, wait, what is this? I walk in in my Toboa outfit and I said nicely, I just got to work to find out my plain cheeseburger. Well, it's not plain. And if you could get me some new fries too. And the cashier just kind of smiled at me and said, Aw, you haven't eaten lunch today? And I told her no and smiled. And the other lady handed me the burger and the fries. Would you like a new drink with that too? I happily said yes. But the one at work was probably watery by now. Um, boy, so this, this poor lady at McDonald's, this fucking furry abomination walks in and, uh, oh God. Apparently he's getting anal orgasms, everybody. So that's cool. Um, get you a girl who can do both anyways. But yeah, he got, he went to a McDonald's and this poor girl at the McDonald's just had to be like, oh shit, he's retarded. Give him whatever he wants. Uh, Ushi Khan makes me feel all Ushi, Daddy. Uh, while well, the convention was a lot of fun, blah blah blah. You can see some like images if you want to go looking for them. I guess it's not really that much of interest here, though. Um, on this page, except for I have too many wolves rain dojinshi to let shit uh, let shit there being untranslated. The translator I have now is really busy. So I've decided to translate them myself. I found these cool kits at howtodrawmanga.com. Uh, you go, bro. You're going to do it. Um, so, yeah, I got not that much of interest here, but this is like one of his old blogs. So that's that's kind of kind of worthy of doubt. Also, his, I, his fascination with I love or with everybody loves Raymond, um, which I mean, is, is true for anybody, honestly. Um, but. But that'll be one of his old blogs. Here we have Sangi Dativus on Patreon, uh, where I don't believe he actually has an account anymore on here, or at least he he is he's not a he's not a creator. I don't think. Maybe he was. He said he was. He said he had multiple Patreons. Shut the fuck up, phone. But he said he had multiple Patreons. Maybe they got shut down because he's a fucking sex weirdo. But, you know, that's okay because he's giving money to Sean every month. So I'm sure I'm, I'm sure BreadTube Man is really happy about that, uh, getting the money from the convicted pedo. So, uh, yeah, that's that's interesting. Uh, he's got the Patreon. What is this? The Discuss? Oh, yes. This is his, like, active fucking Discuss page. We got stuff about well, not active anymore, really. But uh, Chenk Uger, uh, a lot. 
The la Lady Gaga not returning for horse. How do we finally talk about ethics? Uh, the masked singer. Can you fuck off with the stupid bottom thing? Bottom text? I don't want this. God damn it. Kanye West's lift yourself isn't as bad as you think. The phrase men's rights activism is a joke. Try humanism. Why don't we try humanism instead of feminism? Oh, that's right, because you people will get mad. That's right. Um, What could Ted Cruz's campaign have meant when it called... Okay. How to choose the right cartridge for your turntable? Oh, God. Why are these people always into fucking Ubuntu? These fucking people are always into this weird fucking, like, CIA computer shit. Angels with scaly wings review. BGN movie review. I think the only ones he was offending are the majority, and maybe pedophiles. He always seems to punch up and not down. Black girl nerds. This, it's funny how many times this guy talks about the, the, the pedophiles, you know, on, on, his, on his various accounts. Um, it's, it's really interesting. White male super salty about Star Wars having too many women in the cast. So again, again, everybody, just remember that if you find somebody like this in the fucking wild, they're probably a sex weirdo. D don't take it from me. Take it from what we're looking at here. I mean, hey. This is one person on the internet. I'm sure he represents every person on the internet. It's fine. Uh, dog that killed boy in Henderson released after two years in custody. Dogs can't be evil, doofus. He's basically put in doggy prison by being in a, in a rescue. He's not a murderer. He's a dog. Well, if anybody's going to talk to me about dogs, it's definitely... I'm going to listen to Sangi when he talks. Um... <laughs> I'm definitely going to listen to his his opinions about dogs. Uh, since you're so anti-liberal, you must know Fox is hard right. Not like Alex Jones levels, but up there. Also, Breitbart is garbage and literally makes up most of their stories. I saw Fox News today. They were whining about the Clinton campaign working with the FBI. What? They're just trying to distract from the actual impeachment of the president. That's t <laughs> oh, that's wonderful. Thank you. I needed that laugh. Uh, poor ignorant OP. How to record Netflix, blah, blah, blah. Um, uh huh. Crimes against Americans. Uh-huh. Inked for Furry Friday. Kids ruin everything. Yeah, boy, isn't that just the fucking name of your fucking... Isn't that just the t the subtitle of your goddamn existence, isn't it, Sangi? Those kids just keep ruining everything. Indie Furcon, the end result of a series of bad decisions. Aw, oh, that's no way to talk about your existence. Um... Your mom probably should have swallowed you, though. The skeptic feminist YouTuber arrested for murdering female co-host. Uh-huh. Grizzly smile face killer. Furry Friday. Furry legal stories. Boozy's mailbag edition. The rape story got to me having been myself. And while I usually... Nobody... Listen... Nobody fucking cares if you had some unfortunate shit happen to you if you're going to use that as an excuse to fuck children. Nobody fucking cares. At a certain point, it's no longer an excuse and you're just a piece of shit. Nobody gives a shit. Don't fucking use that like it's some... Oh, God. And while I usually think making fun of trigger warnings means you don't care about people with PTSD, well, I'll let it slide this time. Guys... We better be careful here, because if we, you know, he might not let it slide the next time. If we make fun of, of trigger warnings, he might, he might, like, he might not let it slide, and we might have, that might be a red line in the sand for him. He might have to sniff your butt. Uh, the truth is the, uh, the justice system in the U.S. does not know how to handle sex crimes, even with women, and they report it, and, uh... Even go through the humiliating rape kit. The rape kit will likely not be tested for DNA. I like how well... I like how much you know this, Sangi. I'm not even going to question why a convicted sex predator, why a convicted pedophile who's in a group with a bunch of people who drill holes in dogs and fuck them in the brains. I'm not even going to ask why you know so much about the, the rape kit and the, 
the 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 cops not testing it you know i'm just gonna i'm just gonna assume that you saw a movie you know what i'm just gonna assume you watched a lot of svu so uh anti-victims in the fandom and he goes off about how he was raped and blah 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 that's why i fuck kids in the ass now it's fine guys it's it's how i cope guys it's a sexual emergency you don't understand um why homosexual matter marriage matters for straight men nazis murdered homosexuals idiot your icon is ridiculous you do know nazis put homosexuals in the mentally disabled in concentration camps too right YouTubers say the darndest things. Lot of cis male white tears in the comments, Colin P. So, I think that's enough of the disgust. We're going back three years now, but I mean, you know, that's the age that Sangi likes them, so it's fine. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, we're going to move on here. Um, I believe this is one that, uh, this is one that I think Ark, uh, sent me. This is a, uh, uh, an archived thing from his like his his fur affinity about some a some accusations hey everyone some pretty serious accusations have come up and i realize i need to clear my name there have been claims that i was involved in a particularly heinous type of illegal activity the truth is that i have never been engaged in anything illegal with one exception then why were you arrested three times I was arrested on a technicality that involved someone lying to me about their age. Okay, guy. Yeah, I'm sure. We'll just take your fucking word for it. I'm sure it's fine. It's not like you have admitted to liking chi human child penis or anything like that. No, it's fine. It's okay. We'll just take your word for it, dude. It's all right. It was just a mistake. It was they lied about their age. That's clearly what happened. Sure. Uh, right. And then we've got this one here, which is similar about how he uh he got his charge expunged thank to thanks to a skilled attorney in Utah everybody everybody boy how do we feel about that skilled attorney right now that wonderful skilled attorney who basically just allowed a bunch of extra dogs to get fucked why are they using the fucking yakuza font stop Okay, um, I got my charge expunged. I no longer have anything on my background, so now I can freely rent, get a job, and other things that most people don't think about th twice about doing. Obviously, an expungement doesn't change my past, but it does help me move past it and prove to society that I'm not a threat. So this was like two years ago. And uh, from what I understand, this this page got deleted real fucking quick after uh, after the other stuff started coming out so yeah it's a good thing that he's he's now known as no longer a threat to society everybody you know that's that's good um is there anything else i think i think we might be winding down with the with the sangi uh yeah that's about it honestly there's a couple more things there's his weasel and his uh, Guys, the wind's picking up again. I think God got mad at the Sangi stream. Um, let me see. Oh, wait, what? Check the wiki fur. It just cha Oh, God. You fuckers. Don't do that. Remember to keep your fucking hands and legs inside the goddamn... Oh, you fucking idiots. All right, we're checking the goddamn... I'm... I'm... I'm, I'm fucking... Uh... I'm not even going to show what it is. I'm just going to see what it is. I don't want to encourage this dumb shit. Sangi Nativis. You know, it's nice that you've changed the, the thing to to be a little more reflective of uh, of his, you know, actual life. But uh, I don't know. I don't know. I have a feeling they're going to I have a feeling they're going to they're going to turn dial this one back. Yes, some edits have been made to the page. Anyways, um, I was gonna look at the uh, the Ink Bunny. So I said I said at the beginning of the stream I think that Ink Bunny is like his site, and that's not true. Uh, I think his site is Inked Fur, and Ink Bunny is like a different thing. So, uh, so this is his Ink. Am I able to show this? Can I show this? 
Oh god. Should I show oh fucking hell. I'm gonna show this for like two seconds. Look toward the middle top of the screen, chat. Okay, and that's enough of that. So Wow, it is getting pretty fucking windy outside. The gods are angry, everybody. The sea was angry that day, my friends. Like an old man trying to send back soup at a deli. Anyways, uh So that was a tiny tiny bit of his uh his his cub art collection here on uh on Ink Bunny. And uh Oh my god. I'm gonna have to close my window in a little bit, but I also I also like the chaos, so uh, let me see here. I'm gonna show one, one, well, maybe a couple final things here. This is uh, this is like his profile section on this Ink Bunny site. My fursona is pretty much me plus fur. Not very original, I know. Oh, so the so the furry also fucks fucks children. Okay, uh, not very original, I know, but there are some differences. Specifically, my fursona is a red wolf, Canis rufus which is an endangered wolf species that is more lithe in appearance and commonly mistaken for coyotes. Uh, I'm a trance DJ that has a day job as an IT analyst at a successful, well-known video game company. So you're the reason for insert game joke here. <laughs> so you're the reason for Sonic 06. <laughs> so you're the reason for Thief 2014. It all makes sense now. Um, I absolutely love dancing almost as much as fucking, I mean, music itself. Uh, music wise, I'm all about trance and some other forms of electronica, such as trance. You can't say all about trance and some other forms of electronica, such as trance. I bet you fuck kids, you weirdo. Anyways, oh, Euro dance, hard dance, progressive trance, some house and a little breaks sexually i'm full-on homosexual and although i enjoy i usually enjoy dominating i still enjoy seeming submissive at first and wearing girly tight-fitting clothing yeah that's called boys large uh i'm, I'm wondering where you get all the, that tight-fitting clothing why let my lithe frame go to ra waste anyways never say the word lithe again yes i have other furry gallery accounts but all my high-res commissions and commissions and sketches are posted here he works for EA. I bet it was EA. It probably was. So, uh, possibly, I'm not going to show too much of the art here because a lot of it is just like I don't know. It's 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 not like it's his art. It's all commissions from other people. So it's like fairly adequate, I guess, furry art. I don't know. It's fine. I mean, like, it's not. I don't think there's any dicks here. I'm not going to get like banned for it. But it's uh, it's hmm. Anyways, um, what's the next thing? There probably just one. This is the site. This is his his page on Weasel. Um, which oh god, these fucking oh Jesus. Uh, there's not much to see on this one. Uh, there's not much to see on this one. But the one thing I will show, and you can see a tiny bit of the art here. Again, this isn't his art. This is art from other people that he's commissioned, um, but a tiny bit of his art here, you can see. Sangi Nativus, 36, male, Austin, Texas. You have enemies? Good. That means you've stood up for something sometime in your life. Winston Churchill. So remember, chat, uh, if Sangi happens to have enemies, that's only because he took a stand and he stood behind a child. Anyways, so that'll be, I think, probably it for the Sangi uh, coverage. Um, Kurt Cobain dead, donated four ninety nine. <laughs> what? Um, that'll be, I think, about it for the Sangi coverage. We're gonna be getting into some uh, super chats and stuff here in a minute. But uh, yeah, finally, have we've done it? We've done the Sangi stream. Again, there's, uh, you know, there's not that much stuff to talk about with Sangi. He is a fairly interesting individual just for the fact that he is still free and available. You can still find him posting on sites. He's not in jail. The police will not fucking arrest him, apparently, because he has that skilled, skilled lawyer or whatever. But, yeah, Sangi stream. Very interesting stuff.